Enjoying animals and harvesting food, it's happening at a local farm called Keiki and Plow, and the entire community is invited. And joining us now with more is Executive Director Heather Moore. Good morning and welcome. Good morning. Thank you so much for having me today. You know, thanks for being here. This is such a cute concept. You've been around for two years. Yeah. Tell us more about Keiki and Plow. Yeah, so Keiki and Plow is a nonprofit and an organic farm. We're located in Hawaii Kai, and like you said, we're here for the community. We're inviting our Keiki, but also everybody to come out and enjoy the beautiful Aina that we're so wow. lucky to be able to farm. And uh, we have some exciting programs that we offer. Offer every week. Our most popular is our farm play and harvest days. Those are every Tuesday and Friday, and that's a chance for the kids to come out and play. We have chickens and bunnies and goats to visit with, a really just awesome play space as you can see right here. The kids are running up the hill, mud kitchens, digging pits. And the best part is that our farm is open for you to go grocery shopping. And so I've brought an example basket here. Mm -hmm. This is just um, a sample of what's available this week here at the farm. Okay. And so you can go through and just pick anything that looks good to you, fill up your basket, and enjoy. And it's right there by Cocoa Head. Yeah, so you would never know. You would never know. We're a little secret back there. So we're just on the side of Cocoa Head. We have a beautiful view of all of Hawaii Kai and Diamond Head out there. And uh, just behind the high school. So not too far from where so many of our neighbors are already kind of, you know, hanging out. And I described it as being a cute place, and we see kids playing and having fun. But it's a great learning opportunity, not just for kids, but for everyone. Right, and so that's the beauty of the farm. There's so much to just learn about, and we know that kids learn by doing. Mm -hmm. And so by inviting kids and the community to come out, naturally the questions follow. And so we're so lucky on our farm days, we have a chance for the kids to jump in the field and you know join us in planting seeds. We do educational tours throughout the week and coming up we're really excited to announce our spring break programming and is that Monday through Friday during spring break for public schools yeah so we'll be open the week of March 16th through mm -hmm. the 20th we're super stoked because we're gonna be partnering up with some awesome organizations like sustainable coastlines Hawaii we have a whole half day program about sustainability Kids can come out and learn about composting, about plastic pollution, and really just engage hands-on in these kind of big concepts, but breaking it down in a very fun, child-friendly way. And if parents are looking for some place new for parties, you guys also host events. We do. So, like I said, we have such a beautiful space that we want to share it with our community. And so, you know, we're open throughout the week for you to come and join us, but we're also happy to host your event at our space as well. So you've been out there for two years on the east side. Any plans of expanding to other areas of the state? <laughs> I've heard that question a lot. Um, we are very happy with where we're at. We're mm -hmm. looking forward to continuing to build out our programs, but also to hopefully inspire other farms around the island. And, you know, there's this whole national movement of farm to school, and we're really happy to be a part of that and hopefully an example of what's possible. So, yeah. Please come and join us. All right. We have all the information on our website, khun2.com. Heather, thanks for being Thank here. Thank you so much.